other folks that will be joining. Um, so what's, what's noteworthy today before we get started is while we're here uh, at the DNC each day, um, President Trump and uh, Senator Vance are doing battleground states. On Friday, tr uh, President Trump will actually do two separate states. Uh, so we're out in the battlegrounds. We're here in Chicago. We have surrogates and activities in, in battleground states throughout the week, which is a stark contrast uh, to Kamala Harris, who, uh, you know, while we're doing press events here, the president will be doing gaggles and other, uh, other press availabilities. And apart from, you know, a flyby at a gas station, uh, we're not hearing a lot from Kamala Harris about these policies that she's talking about. And I think there's a good reason. Uh, when she does uh, stop and take a question like she did yesterday and was asked how uh, she'll pay for the proposals that she's advocating for, she told you it was, it's a mistake to ask how things will be paid for. I think that's a good summary of, uh, of her economic policies. Um, it's clear the Democrats think the best strategy they have is to keep uh, Harrison Waltz away from you all, and, and we, uh, we stand in contrast to that. So today we're going to talk about uh, contrasting economic policies. You recall, recall from the convention, uh, we had a day which was about making America wealthy again, and the senators are here to help uh, contrast uh, the Trump vision for making America wealthy again compared to the policies of uh, Harris 